Good morning, afternoon, evening. It is Alexis Arcade, and today is a beautiful day to not be outside, but instead to continue our journey here on Ark Survival Evolved. Now, if you couldn't tell, I am over at our community center because what I am going to do today is I am going to turn our little garden crop plot thing up there that you can see right behind the Stegos, the swinging tail, into a greenhouse. That's right, in the update 233, a greenhouse is part of it, and I'm so excited. But the reason I am standing here next to this cooking pot is because I don't have enough angry points to learn everything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a mind wipe tonic to learn it. And I have a recipe right here, which I have come to the realization that is not correct. Um, I did some Googling and the, the appropriate amount of resources is 24 cooked prime meat, 200 mejo berries, 72 narcotics, 72 stimulants, and 20 uh, magic magic mushrooms, 20 rare mushrooms, and 20 rare flowers. So I'm not quite sure how long this takes to cook up. So, you know. We'll just sit here and wait because I also want to give a huge, beyond huge thank you to everyone for your freaking amazing and incredible support. I can't tell you. I've been like floating on cloud nine all day today. So thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. You are absolutely amazing. Like amazing. You see that? Like so amazing. I'm going to take my helmet off. You can look me in the eye. You're amazing. Amazing. All right, all right, enough of the enough of the mushy stuff. Let's see if this sucker is made up. It is not. All right, um, so, oh my gosh. Oh, because I forgot to put the water in there. Silly me. Oh, oh, go in there, go in there. There we go. Okay, phew. Okay, so, um, I am going to keep my stats relatively the same. Uh, a few things are going to change probably, like, I don't know. I don't need food or water that high. My melee damage will probably be a little bit lower. But anyway, all right. I'm going to wait for this uh, Mind Wipe Tonic to make up. I'm going to rework all my stats. I'm going to learn all the Engrams. And when I'm back, we will go ahead and look at the resources necessary for the greenhouse and then get to the collecting if we need to. You guys, so I've got my stats all reworked out and everything. I learned all the Engrams. So here we are. Um, let's see what we need. We need metal, crystal, and cementing paste. So they're actually not, well... That's actually kind of expensive. Because um, crystal is just, it's not rare, it's just hard to gather. You don't get a whole lot when you gather it. Um, cementing paste isn't too bad if you get, you know, a froggy frog. So, and I've got plenty of metal in the fabricator over there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go out and gather the crystal and cementing paste. And when I'm back, we will get to crafting all that we need to get our greenhouse started. Um, I don't have my cold clothes on me. I do not. So, Howie, if you don't mind, we're going to make a quick trip to get some cold clothes. And then we're going to go gather the crystal and cementing paste. Okie dokie, you guys. So we are back and we have enough to make some stuff. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we can craft 26 walls. So let's go ahead and craft... Tw Actually, you know, let's just craft them all. We're just going to place windows or walls for right now. But you know what I noticed and something that John Versus pointed out to me is that they have a window, which is what you would put in a window wall, but there's no window wall. Unless I'm missing something, unless he's missing something. Yeah, there's no... Metal, there's no glass window frame for that. So that's funny. That's interesting. But everything is a window in a glass house anyway. So, you know. So let's go ahead and, well, well I guess we'll just wait for them to be done at cooking. So what are we going to run out of, though? Let's see. Probably, oh, crystal. We're going to run out of crystal, huh? That's going to be the resource that we need the most. Hostess with the mostess. I don't know why I said that. Alrighty. Yep. 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 All right. Let's tee you on out of there. 104 pounds, and let's go up to here. I'm excited to see what this is going to look like, and I'm going to assume that it does not get rid of the metal um, gates. So we are definitely going to have to remove those. Did I say gates? I meant fencing, but they work. They work. All right. So let's go ahead and get rid of this. Oops, I did not hold it to activate long enough. And this one. And we'll place it. We're placing our first greenhouse wall. Ooh, I like it. Let's place our second greenhouse wall. Ooh, 
this is actually like to be honest you guys i wasn't like super stoked about like the greenhouse so i was like ah, i mean it's gonna be neat but like that actually looks really really cool oh it reminds me of like being in a like i think also because of like our view it reminds me of being like on a really high building and looking down at the windows but not only that is it gives the greenhouse effect for our plants which is something i actually need to oh yeah you see there's like 0.0% percent greenhouse effect. I am going to have to research that a little bit more before the next time I talk to you. So I can talk to you knowledgeable on the subject. But um, uh, I didn't. I have a bad habit of not holding the demolish. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this first layer of walls. Oh, hey, 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 Ringo. Uh, I'm going to finish the first la uh, level of walls around the side. And I'm probably not going to take it up very high probably one more version um one more version of walls one more row of walls and then oh crap but we have this and we probably have to fit it all the way around that don't we all right well we'll we'll, 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 we'll work with it we'll play with it so anyway i'm gonna get this part done and um yeah we'll be back momentarily you guys here's just a better idea of what the shape is going to look like uh you can see where it's going to level out right here down the center where the door is and then these sides are going to be sloped i have gone ahead and planted some seeds that way um hopefully when it's done and we'll get the full greenhouse effect going uh also i just wanted to show you guys something funny with this update so uh if you watch my beer brawl video you know that there was a beer brawl here but when version uh 233 was released um, it wiped industrial cookers and beer barrels. Um, thankfully, I, I had thought about actually doing an industrial cook pot this week, but I didn't. And so that would have sucked. And then when version 233.1 came out, um, your beer barrels and, and cook pots would be able to made again, but you lost the one that you had made. So that kind of sucks. So anyway, I'm still working on the greenhouse. Hopefully we'll, we'll have it done here shortly and then we'll go and we'll experiment. Plus, I also want to play with um, putting the windows on like a like a house or something. So like my house back at my base. So we'll get to that. We'll get to that too, you guys. I'll be back. We are finishing up the greenhouse and uh, I noticed that these walls are like, you can see like perfectly through them. But these ones have like a film on them. And I'm not quite sure why, but it looks freaking awesome. I mean, this whole thing looks awesome. I'm really, really excited for this to be done. And I don't know if you guys noticed earlier, but I planted crops. And I'm actually working on this the next day. Um, so they've all died, so I need to replant them. Um, but yeah, I just thought the fact that that was, like, clear was cool. Are they clear from the outside like they are on the inside? Let's have a look-see. Mm, no, they aren't. Interessant. Interessant. All right, gotta go get more crystal. And, uh... I'll be back. Okay, you guys. So one thing to note, just real quickly, is that uh, these walls break. I just had a Carno come and attack, and uh, it I think he like hit it once. He was only level 40, and this broke. So I'll have to repair that and have to keep Crystal on standby. But as you can see, like this stuff is just a growing. Um, I've been gone for about maybe 10, 15 minutes, and we've already got them looking like this. I didn't have any seeds to plant in here, and I accidentally planted a long grass over here instead of a, what are these, what are these called again? I don't even remember, I think, uh, yeah, whatever this, Sava root, that's right, instead of a Sava root, so, um, yeah, so this is coming along real, real nice, oh, we gotta go check on how windows work, we'll go put some windows in over at my place, uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and repair this wall, and then put these freaking dinos back on top of there. Oh, I made a mess out of that. Um, <laughs> so I'll be right back. Uh, I'm going to get all this sort sorted and then head over to my base to test the windows. And I'll be right back. Guys, so what I realized after enclosing this whole thing in is that our little irrigation tanks down there, how are they going to get water if there's a roof on top of it? So what I'm thinking and what I'm hoping is that if I remove this first row of slanted roofs right over them, that they will, in fact, get water. So let's go ahead and start to demolish those. Ooh, ooh, God, that's a really bad sound to make when you hear them breaking. Ooh, God, oh no. Okay, if you don't like this, cover your ears for like 30 more seconds. Ooh, oh, oh no, I broke the wrong one. All oh, poo. All right, well, I will go ahead and finish the demolition and I think it's, it's raining right now, maybe, yeah? I feel like I hear it and it was. Okay, there we go, delayed rain. So, they say not irrigated right now. Oh, but they are full of water. Uh, that, I wonder if that was from before. So, anyway, we will, we'll check later to make sure that they're still full of water because this is, you know, spewing out water over here. So, I'm going to go ahead and fix this and then we will continue to go about our day. 
So here we are at my house. I don't know why I talked like that. That was really weird. I'm so sorry. Let's go ahead and see if these windows will work. That is my pike. There we go. Oh, nice. Look at this. Oh, I love this, actually. Uh, let me go inside and try to put the windows in. I don't know why I went outside. Okay. Woo. Yes. Nice. I'm hungry. Where's the window? Work it. Do it. Strut it. Oh, yeah. This is cool. I really, really dig this. Okay. I'll have to get some um, door frames made up so I can put them there. I think I didn't. I definitely didn't make enough. But we're just seeing. We're just seeing the looks of it. That's a. There we go. Not a door frame. I mean, like an actual door. And. Uh, yeah, I actually. Oh, am I out? Am I out? Yes, I'm out. Okay. I like that. I actually. I'm not quite sure I like the metal bar across it, but I, it's not enough to keep me from, like, actually, like, enjoying it. So, yeah, at least we know you can put them in window frames. It's really nice to know. Uh, and I assume I can put the doors in here. Um, and I didn't make any, so actually, yeah. So we'll just, we'll just let that one go. But, um, yeah, that's totally cool. And you know what? We're not going to let that go. We are not going to let that go. I have crystal over here. I think I can make a door. I just want to see what it looks like. And by the way, you guys, it's really late for me. It's like almost 3 a.m., so I might be a little losing my mind just a wee bit. Um, where's my crystal? Where's my crystal at, yo? Ooh, is it in here? It is not. It's in my fabricator. Let's go to the fabricator. Okay, mm okay. I'm not way down. Nice, nice, nice. Let's pop it in here. And then what else do I need? Oh, cementing paste. Oy vey. It's just like all about the cementing paste, isn't it? And I don't have any. I don't have any. Why would it be in there? Wrong one. Ugh. All right. Well, we'll just we'll just believe. We just know. We we just know that a door works. Um. So I'm gonna go ahead and fly back to our um uh, community center to check on our plants. If I can find my bird, that would be great. There he is. All right, and uh, once I get over there, I will be back. All right, so I just wanted to check out what's going on with this greenhouse effect thing. So I have 300% right, and I'm reading on the wiki that a crop plot that is placed directly beneath the greenhouse ceiling will benefit from a maximum 300% greenhouse effect. At two walls high, the effect will have diminished to 210% greenhouse effect. But the thing is, is mine is definitely higher than two. Um, so I'm not quite sure. Maybe I'm reading it wrong. It's saying something about a 50% ceiling coverage. It'll still apply the 300%. Um, but that's if the crop, pot, the crop plot does not have to be completely under a ceiling. So I'm just not totally sure what's going on. So, I mean, I'm not complaining that I'm having 300%. Look, our, our plants are doing beautiful. They're growing. They're looking real, real pretty. So we're just going to continue to let them grow and I'll check on it later and maybe it's because it's fresh. I don't know. We shall see. We shall see. We are here. Moment of truth. <gasps> Look at all the veggies. Oh my God. Veggies for days. I'm so, so excited. Okay. Okay. Where to begin? Where to begin? Where to begin? Let's, we'll start over here with the lemons or the citronol if you want to be technical. All right. We got 30 citronol, uh, 18 um, long grass, 22 rock carrot. And 24 potatoes. That's amazing. Wow. These, these grew, I mean, I've been on for a while. But, like, these grew way faster than, like, anything ever does. Um, so that's really, really cool. And not to mention this little uh, scenario over here with the hole in the windows for the water. Worked like a charm. I know I'm a genius. You don't have to tell me twice. So I'm really excited about this. And like I was saying earlier, this greenhouse effect, there's supposed to be a bunch of math stuff to it. But I have the 300%, um, even though my ceilings are really high. Maybe it's all, all about how many you have, too. But I can't say for sure because I don't have very many. And I know that John Versus has, it has a greenhouse, too. And I believe his to be smaller. So 
I'm not 100% sure what's going on with that. But that is going to be it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a comment or a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. That way you know when I put out new videos. And I'm going to say it again. I've been saying it all weekend in every single video that I've put, been putting out um, since this weekend. <laughs> but your guys' support has been insane. Insane in the membrane. Just absolutely insane. I can't, like, it's just, it's so surreal. And I just, I just... I just, I just, that's it, I just. So anyways, thank you guys again so, 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 so very, very much. And I will tech to you, ta and I will tech to you guys later. Oh, pardon me. I will talk to you guys later. Take care. Bye.